decide to get involved in this um, a little bit for a selfish reason. It is Part of it is giving back um, and I think that's a very good feeling to volunteer to do something uh, and to raise money and, and to help an organisation. I'm actually feeling really quite privileged and honoured that we'd be able to um, experience this sort of thing. It's, it's really totally left field. It's amazing. Well, the message I'll take home with me is that I can achieve anything I want as long as I put my mind to it and I stick to it. And it mightn't always be easy, but you just keep the end in mind and take it at little steps. You don't have to race and get through it. Little steps, little goals and get past them and yeah, it works. Um, yesterday we did our first school visit and it, it made me feel um, very emotional. It stirred up lots of feelings because up until that point it was all about us riding a bike and getting through that but we came here and we raised money um, to help these children learn how to save so they can have a better future so when we walked into that classroom and they were all looking up at us smiling it was it was re it really hit you that it's not really about you it's not what you came here although it's making me sad again now but it's, it was good to think yep it, it, all the people that gave money to us and yeah, this is what it's for. I, I think I've had a feeling all along that that's, that's why I was here. Um, I suppose though the confrontation of walking into a classroom and having the beaming faces smiling up at you, yeah, that's when um, the, the tears started to well. <laughs> yeah. It's really pleasing to see um, the results that are actually coming out of, of the program that they're being put through. And I think that going forward that's going to be a huge benefit to the children and I'm just amazed and everybody should be so proud of, of, the syst of this system that's actually been introduced for the children and to see today that um, we've actually visited the poorest school and 99% of those children put their hands up to say that they'd actually started a savings account and to note that only two of the children prior to the program had a savings account going and I think that that is just sensational. You can never, never ever experience this sort of thing ever again. If you don't do this program you will never know. You will never know. It is well worth the $37 a month for a village entrepreneur but the $3.80 per year to teach a child how to save is invaluable and to us $3.80 you can't even get a coffee for that so try and find some money and send it over these people they can do great things and they are but they just need a little hand I, I can't believe the, the different experiences that we've had and every day there's been some new adventure whether it be challenging emotional it's just been sensational it's just an amazing experience to see how we're helping build this country back up, how CUFA is doing a fantastic job in helping these people become independent and be able to sustain their own life and it's just fantastic. So if you can go through this program and to make a difference to someone else, you should do it. Definitely. <laughs> ครับน้องเตียงเตียงจางเตียงกันมาดูน้อยขอดได้ไหมมันต้นไทยเมนไทยไหมมันต้นไทยยังเมียนปกที่เนี่ยยอมกับปกอุกซ่าไอ้เต